We're so glad you're joining us this morning for a special edition of Great Day Live featuring Furniture Fair, Ed Hartman and Anthony Munoz too. Now you've seen Ed and Anthony on commercials, but Furniture Fair has a rich history. Ed, let's start with you. When did it all begin? Well, thank you for having us and thanks for coming to our beautiful store here. Uh, at uh, Taylorsville and Harshburn Parkway. Uh, the Furniture Fair history goes back to 1963. Now I always say Pete Rose was a rookie that year. <laughs> and uh, Bob and Kate Daniels uh, wanted to open up a furniture store in Erlanger, Kentucky, and the name Furniture Fair because he wanted brand name furniture at a fair price. So he started the business. Um, they had eight children uh, and uh, Four of them are in the business, and uh, it was started out with about 5,000 square foot store in Erlanger, Kentucky, and now we have 11 stores, and of course this is a beautiful uh, store that we have here in uh, Louisville. Uh, there are three brothers that run the company and have, uh, along with their dad, he retired in uh, uh, probably the 80s, early 80s, uh, and had passed away right after he retired. Uh, the business has just had a complete change when you come in here and see this store and how furniture stores used to line up, you know, sofas like soldiers and, and that was just one after another, concrete floors. Uh, this is just a magnificent designer showroom. So uh, uh, we keep growing and we hope to grow more and uh, we're glad to be here. Now, I know a little bit later in the program, our GDL reporter Joanne Dixon gets to take a deep dive into your relationship. I mean, you make us laugh and smile. We love your commercials. But just in a nutshell, give us at least a little sneak peek as to how both you and Anthony got involved. Well, I have my story and... And, and I have the real true story. The truth. <laughs> you can see what kind of show we're gonna have this morning. Ed, I gotta tell you, little guy, but he likes to embellish just the... <laughs> A little bit more. We'll take that. <laughs> no, I, you know, I, I just say that, uh, you know, back in 1993 when I retired from the NFL, I was just a little tired from 13 years of banging against people all, all day long, and I just wanted to take a break. And I usually, I'm usually pretty good returning phone calls and messages. And I had an agency that was continued to call me. We have an opportunity. We do this, and I kept pushing them off. Uh, did not call them back. And then I had a call from this guy Ed Hartman. He wanted to have lunch, and I didn't know what it was in regards to. And I said, well, agency, I'll hold off. Okay, I like meeting with people, so I'll have lunch with Ed Hartman, and here we are. Ed, what was it about Anthony that you just said, this is, this is it? Well, the, well the, tell him the truth. I was like 10th in line of your choices to be your partner. Well, that was, be, that was the after the dogs and the cats <laughs> okay, and the uh, <laughs> adventure guy. Furniture Fair, the owners wanted uh, to have me uh, get someone to be a spokesperson. So I, I had ball players from uh, baseball and, and, of course, other uh, personalities. And the whole thing was... You know, they just didn't fit. And then Anthony retired, and it was uh, 1992. I'd been at Furniture Fair for two years. I started in 90. So, uh, you know, we've been together. I've been at Furniture Fair for 31 uh, years in the furniture business, and Anthony and I have been together for 29 of those. But it was just the, the fact of he's just a great guy. And then, you know, the owner said, you know, big guy, you know, big selection, you know, low prices, you know, it and, fits. and, and, and it just went. So first time we met and we were going to do a commercial and well, we had lunch. Uh, I, I think I bought that time and ever since he's bought. So, you know, uh, it's, but, um, it was, well, tell the truth. We got it free because they were big fans of yours at the <laughs> restaurant. <laughs> I mean, and I'm meeting a lot of big fans of yours around. So, Let's talk about this because we're really going to get an opportunity. And again, you're going to see we're going to have so much fun today. But we also want to talk about the furniture, something that I try not to do on Great Day Live. I'm when I'm working is shop, but I can't help it. I've already tagged some things that I will be buying today here at Furniture Fair. But what sets you apart? Well, I think there's uh, several things. Um, w we uh, certainly get involved in the community, which I think on a later segment, we'll talk more about that. Um, Anthony's foundation that we're tied in uh, really well with and have since it started 20 years ago. Yep. And, uh, but it's, we offer the consumer a beautiful place to shop um, and we give you choices. 
So you know your budget and you know kind of what you want to spend. So we have 399 sofas and then we have $3,000 sofas. We have custom orders. Uh, we have different, you know, four different ways to shop and uh, we keep kind of metamorphosing uh, into what we think a, a consumer really would like to do in shopping, relaxed. Uh, we don't want to let you alone, but we want you to be comfortable and we'll back away. And, but we are here to serve you and uh, make, your, make your home as comfortable as you come into ours and see how we decorate. I think one of the words, if I can just jump in, he mentioned serve, it's service. I mean, not only is a spokesperson with Ed, but we are a customer of Furniture Fair just come to our house. Uh, but I recommend a lot of people to Furniture Fair. They'll ask me, and of course they see the spots, but the one thing they talk about is the service, how well they're served, delivery, and after they're, they're, they're delivered. So I think when uh, Ed mentioned serve, I'd have to say the service is amazing at Furniture Fair. Well, and I'll even add to that in my short time of knowing you. I mean, coming up in the show, we're gonna share four ways to shop at Furniture Fair, but already your team, I've had some questions about things. You'll accommodate people like me who don't have that gift of design and all of that. What's trending? What goes together? Can you help me pick out this with this? I mean, you truly have a team full with their hearts to serve. Well, and I think we try to, uh, you know, improve our uh, culture uh, of our employees. And uh, it's, it's really a family. It really is. And um, I always say that, you know, I was adopted. You know, they, uh, the brothers say they picked me up along I-75 and look what I found. But it's been a great relationship. Uh, everybody thinks I own the business and Anthony owns the business. We don't. It's the brothers. But uh, they give us the opportunity to have fun. And uh, it's kind of we set the tone and we just are so happy to be here. And, and again, we've been doing it for 29 years and uh, it's been a great relationship for all parties. And you're still smiling. So clearly the partnership, the relationships, it's going well. Well, you've spent some time with him. Spend 29 years and he'll keep <laughs> you smiling. That's why I keep smiling. I'm telling you, stay tuned to hear what, well, I'm just going to be honest. Our GDL reporter Joanne Dixon is calling a deep dive into the bromance right here. The Anthony and Ed, true friends, true relationship. Well, again, we're so glad to have you joining us this morning for a special edition of Great Day Live here at Furniture Fair. Coming up, we'll have more of course with Anthony and Ed too.